everyone. My name is Trish and these are my kids, King Palma and King Taitaya. And my husband is one recording right now. Today I want to talk about the state of our children here in South Africa. Over the past weeks we heard about the various murders that have taken place in schools. Yes, in schools. And this murder is not committed by grown-up people but by children. It's very saddening to hear that a young boy had just lost his life because the other kid murdered him. A whole life I had destroyed because of what happened between these two children. So I began to wonder what is going on with our children. You see, this is a time bomb clicking, and if we don't address it, it's gonna get out of control. Just recently in um, in Limpopo, young kids killed a person. So what's wrong? What's going on in South Africa? I want to begin to look at this issue from home. Because if you see a child reacting like that outside, which means there is something wrong at home. They say charity begins at home. What is happening at home that these children are so angry to the extent of killing each other? Are they being exposed to abuse at home? Are they angry because someone is not available in their life? Is it demons? Yeah. Is it drugs? Yeah. What's happening in South Africa? If you look at the statistics in South Africa, it shows that many children are being raised by single parents. You know, when this thing, marriage was initiated by God, God knew the importance of marriage. But today we have lost it all. We have lost the importance of a family structure, a father, a mother, and the children coming together as a family unit. People are just going around making kids, and they don't want to take responsibility for them. This had to stop South Africa. If you know you can take care of a child, rather don't make the baby. It doesn't stop on you and your girlfriend coming together. There's a responsibility after a child. And these kids, they are left with no one, no mentor, no one to guide them. And they are so angry because their parents are not in their lives and they are being raised by grandparents who are so tired and want to take a rest, but you are giving them more responsibility. These kids, they don't have a, a sense of belonging, a sense of identity, and they are so angry at everyone. So now we have to wake up because this is a ticking time bomb and it's getting out of control. Let's get our families together. Let's fix this South Africa. We can't let our children go on like this. These are the future leaders of tomorrow. And if, if we don't take care of this, we are losing it, South Africa. I hope this is a wake up call to somebody. Thank you very much. This is Trish, reporting live from the park. And also subscribe to our, our YouTube channel to receive more videos like this. We'll be talking about what's happening in South Africa.